Hello, welcome to the Showcase channel. Um, today I have a, another box break. Um, it's of a newer product that I've recently purchased. Um, this video, I'm actually, as you can see, going to try doing a uh, new camera angle to see if it works better for my, um, you know, basically for the camera, for the internet and stuff like that. I see a lot of people use the same camera and the same webcam that I have, but I think because of my internet speed, um, if I keep something in front of it for too long, it tends to like lag it out. And it tells me, like, while I'm in the middle of doing the video, it'll tell me to, like, reconnect or an error has occurred or something like that. Um, so, anyways, I know y'all don't care about that. I know y'all just want to see the break. Um, today I have a 2012-13 um, Innovation Basketball Box Break. It's supposed to be one pack per box, eight cards per pack, two autographs, and one memorabilia card. Um, here's the box right here. Um, I have not finished opening anything yet. Uh, you know, I was just in the middle, middle of filming it. Um, I did rip off, I did take off the, the wrap and everything already, so I know y'all aren't able to see that. So, um, I did get this, I got this box from Florida. I actually got two boxes like this. Um, I have just the other one in my, in my room. So, I, I, I usually try to keep, uh, I'm all my box breaks, I usually try to write down the state of where I got it from just to try to interact a little better with the people because people might, some people might think it's cool, some people not, I don't know. But I just wanted to show off the price too. Um, like these, like the guy had these listed at like for like 115 I guess, I guess at his store. Um, I only paid like maybe $60 for this box, so, you know, it's pretty cheap. It was like, almost half of the price but anyways that was the seal um, here's the box here um, it's empty as you can see um, I haven't opened um, the main pack I open I have opened the Kobe pack already the main pack um, I have not opened yet but anyways there's the box here um, I don't know if I'm gonna like this camera angle or not because I have less room to like maneuver around and stuff like that but I don't know the audience and stuff. I don't know if you if you guys like the camera angle better and it works and stuff like that. Just let me know. Uh, you comment or something like that. If you like this camera angle better, um, yeah, just PM me or comment below, I guess. Um, Cause I've been I've been using uh, I usually just put this the camera up on like a box, and so that way it ang it, ang it angles down. It angles down uh, towards my table here. So it gives me, like, I have, like, a lot of more room to, like, maneuver the cards in my hands and stuff like that. But, anyways, um, here is the, the Panini Kobe pack. And it's already been opened. As you can see. Uh, the cards are here. Got this Kobe here. And the champ, um, I guess it's from, a, it's got wearing his champion shirt. Let's do it like this. There's that one. Pretty cool. There's another Kobe. Just a regular. There's another Kobe. Here's a Kobe All-Star card. They're all just uh, regular base cards though, so I thought that was pretty cool. Alright, and now we have the pack here innovation basketball pack I've already broken the, the seal on top however I have not looked at the cards so all right I've never opened this product before so I'm pretty psyched to see who I'm gonna get all right and there goes the innovation pack all right, right away, I see a lot of cards, really thick pack. Uh, base card of Dennis Rodman for the Detroit Pistons, really nice. Wish it was in a Bulls uniform, but can't do nothing about that. Pretty nice, nice looking card. 
Set the base card non numbered. Um, I guess they're non numbered. I've never seen these cards before, so there's what the back looks like. Here's a Bulls, but it's not for a player who I want. Joaquim Noah. Base card for the Chicago Bulls. Joaquim Noah. Regular. Base card. Pretty cool. Oh, nice. Dang, check this out. This is going to be going in my PC for sure. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, this is all I saw right here on the back. But I just saw it said Miami Heat, LeBron James. Pretty sick. That's just the back of it, though. Bam. Check that out. That's freaking sick. LeBron James producers. Sorry for the glare or anything, but that's pretty sweet. Got the mojo hit too. Corners are pretty good. I'm just going to look it over really quick, but that's a really nice looking card. Oh my gosh. That's a really sweet card. Sick. LeBron James producers. Damn, that's a nice card. These cards are really thick too, really uh really well done, so alright, anyways, here we go with this card here. Oh, this is the uh this is the glass card or something like that, isn't it? These are the uh the Panini um, I think yeah, I think these are some kind of glass cards, but this is Tony Parker though. But it's weird because it just says like it's just got the picture of him. It has the NBA logo and his team, and it doesn't say. Oh, it does say at the bottom. It says on the back here. But you have to put it up against the light. Oh yeah, you can't see his name unless you put it up against something uh, dark. It's at the very bottom. At the very bottom down here, like below the innovation logo, it's down here, but you can't see it unless you put it up against something dark, I guess, or something like that. Because you can see it on the back, but it's backwards. God, that's really cool, though. Yeah, if you ever get a chance to buy this product, they're really cool cards. Like this card has got like a. Uh, I think I was watching a video from SMB Pinoy. And he had bought one of a card like this for some player or whatever, and he said it looks like water. And yeah, it does kind of look like water. But these are really cool. They're pretty uh, flimsy cards, but they're pretty cool though. Tony Parker, it's like a glass card. So, and those are just all the inserts. So, anyways, we have here first autograph, sticker auto. First autograph here, fine print autographs. JJ Reddick, really nice card. Non number, there you go, you can see the name a little better there. JJ Reddick, sticker auto, fine print autograph, Milwaukee Bucks. Really nice card. Oh, here you go. Uh, rookie card, rookie autograph, real big autograph too. Innovative ink of Kent Bazemore, a rookie auto. Golden State Warriors, really big auto. It almost looks like uh, two cards though. If you can tell the way it looks. It looks almost like two cards. But it's uh, it's not. It's a really big autograph though. Kent Bazemore, B A Z E M O R E Bazemore, I guess. 
not numbered. I wish they were numbered, but can't do anything about that. You can see there's his name right there. You can see it a little better. So that's Kent Bazemore, rookie autograph. Pretty sweet. My favorite card still so far is the uh, um, is the LeBron card. All right, I think here we go. Let's see. Here is the clear card. Here we got another rookie card of Tor T O R Nike Tranquilita for the Brooklyn Nets. This is a really sweet card too. And I like these cards because they're numbered out of out of three forty nine. This is number one seventy five out of three forty nine. But they're clear though, you can see. Pretty cool. Never seen a card like that before. Pretty nice. Rookie card too. Alright, and then the last card. Oh wow, that's really cool. Well, I didn't expect that. That's really nice. Maybe that's why I was so sick, because I saw this card. Here's the player it is. That card should be, uh, should sell pretty well. I'm not going to keep this card, but this card should be pretty good. It's got a uh, Kenneth Farid, or Ferris, F-A-R-I-E-D. And it says Rookie Basketball on it. Rookie Basketball. Here we go, right here. Kenneth Farid or Farid. It's a, I guess it's a game used basketball. It's a kicker though, man. This is only numbered out of ten, so there's only ten of these cards. It's number nine out of ten, which is pretty crazy. Number nine out of ten. There you go, you can see it right there, number 9 out of 10. I've seen a couple of these cards pulled before, not like this player, but uh, specifically these cards. So that's pretty cool though. That's probably the hit of the box right there, because those other two autographs, those suck, so I wasn't too impressed with those. But that's pretty sweet though. Alright, so you got the 9 out of 10, Kenneth Farad, Game Use, Basketball. And then you got the two autographs, who I don't really care about. And you got the two base cards, and then you have these two dudes right here. You got the LeBron James producers, and you got the Tony Parker glass. So those are probably my three hits on the box. Those are pretty cool. I don't know if these are going to stay or not, but oh, there you go. That was it right there, though. Tony Parker glass, my number out of 10, 9 out of 10. Game used basketball and LeBron James producer. So, and all the other cards, um, like the two base cards, I got the two base cards, and you got the two autos, two autographs here. Um, I don't really care for those. And then you have the clear card here. Um, if any of you guys out there PC those players, um, PM me or comment below and maybe we can figure out like a trade or something like that. I'll trade you like an autograph for an autograph or I don't know something. Anyways guys I hope you all enjoyed the video um, and let me know if you like the new camera angle. Um, it's just something I kind of thought of or whatever so um, anyways that was probably the last break of the day. Um, I may do another one later, I'm not sure. I hope y'all have a good one. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Thanks, bye.